How's it going everybody? Welcome to the Scarecorp channel. Today I like to do a review on my Hungarian trunching shovel. Let's take a look. Alright, so this is the Hungarian trunching sh shovel. It uh, more likely dates back to World War II. It's very hard to find out the actual date of these uh, things. So it comes in this canvas uh, military uh, pouch. It's got the leather around the side with like a loop with a plastic dowel. Um, and at one time it would have been uh, oiled so it would have been uh, waterproof so everything's I think pretty much washed off but uh, you can redo it again uh, the only thing I really don't like about this is the the dowel here it's kind of flimsy and I could see this uh, string breaking off um, so so that's probably the only thing so I might have to do something about that the shovel is about 19 and a half inches long um, with the wood and everything. It's about uh, 8 inches by 6 inches. Um, it's got these five rivets here holding it in place, so it's, it's very sturdy. Uh, there's nothing really that you know you can do to this thing to, to damage it. It's got this cool stamp on it. I'm not sure if you could see it. Uh, it's got a 4 and then uh, in bigger letters 1893 and it's got like an S um, and a dot there. I'm not sure exactly what that means, but um, uh, well, the 1893 is probably the uh, the year these things or the company started. So uh, it's very cool. Um, the the handle here, I think it's uh, around uh, eight inches as well, maybe nine inches. Uh, very uh, good weight. I think it's about three pounds. It's a decent weight. It's you know hefty, so um, you could uh, sharpen one side for doing some sort of uh, chopping or whatever with it if you wanted to. Um, it's uh, you know it's it's built nice, and I use it for uh, you know bushcrafting and that. Um, it's, it seems to to work quite well for that. So, all right, guys, that's it for this video. Please uh, stay tuned for other military surplus um, equipment I'll be reviewing shortly. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button or feel free to like this video. Well, that is it for my time and as always, I thank you for yours. We'll see you in my next video. Bye.